Right, hello everybody. Here we are in Mains Park Wigan. It is Friday the 28th of June, 2013. If for any reason you're checking, it's 1913. Uh, somebody's been messing about with your clock. Or you've been time travelling. Either way, get up to date, man. So, yeah, what, what's t important about today? This beautiful little dog here, Rosie. It is her birthday, isn't it, Tootsie? And how old is she? She's 14. 14, eh? How's that good age? We do all this uh, inhuman years crap. You know, like humans have a different calendar than rest of dogs. You know, which I think stupid lately, you know, because sun goes up, sun goes down, 24 hours. Sun goes up, sun goes down, 24 hours. You know what I mean? Eh? For dogs. Do dogs don't wake up in the morning and go, Phew, it's all right for him. Sun only goes up and down once. For us, it goes up and down seven times. But no, yeah, you, you times it by seven, don't you? So you work it out. So technically, Rose is 98. But if we're saying this is a 98 year old having a good mooch and a sniff ain't perk, um, I've not seen anybody that age mooching and sniffing. I'm not saying that they can't, but uh, anyway, look at that. Bloody grotty it is, though, isn't it? Go on then. Just to show you, and this is a. Uh, a shame some of these fur weather folk you know we, we come in park every day us except for when we don't and uh, no we're not fur weather folk hey Rosie look at the no, no we're not fur weather folk we, we they, these like having a walk every day you know so we uh, we come out we have a good mooch round Rosie Rosie Go on. I know you won't go up there, but they're still fencing... Well, they are fencing off, even though some dickheads have knocked the fences down. <whistles> go on, then. So... See, that, that's the only thing with Rosie. She's still in good, isn't it? Well, she takes her time. Yeah, but there's no rush. Uh, me and my wife have got the day off work today, anyway. Because we, we always take uh, a day off work when it's Rosie's birthday, Tix's birthday. Now, yeah, pigeons, I'm out for you. Yeah, you should be giving stuff to her anyway, it's her birthday, you know. Yeah. Look at that, he's absolutely grotty today, though. Our plans have been scuppered. Yeah. <whistles> See, hey, get, get from behind that fence, it's not cold, it's. Yeah. <whistles> you, you'll get done. And then he'll have a go at me, and I'll get done. And then I'll have to start writing letters and complaining. Mm. I'll say something about human rights and canine rights and uh, I, I know I'm ranting away here yeah, but uh, I thought you can come with us and uh, have a have a bit of a, a tip out. Hey. But um no as I say it's a birthday, we, we we take the day off work, we celebrate. Come on. Hey up some council workers here. And the fancy cars. Oh, it? Go on. Go on then. Come on. Rosie. Go on then. There we are. She's here. Hey? What you want? Squirrels? Where's them squirrels? Oh, she's found a ball. My God. See, oh, I don't know. Look at this. Rosie. He should not bloody show me now. It's not even a ball, it's, it's half a ball. Looks like a bust head jog cross with a tea bag. Bloody hell. Well, she's happy. She's happy when she finds summit. Come on. I'll tell you what, it's all busy today. There's streaming across there, there's lorries going up and down. Rosie! Anyway, what was I saying before I interrupted myself with chunnerings? Um, come on then. <coughs> But we'll get run over by one of these men in these cars. It's like the Fast and the Furious on a budget. But, uh, yeah, our plans today was to go up Livington with a picnic, have a little bit of a walk round, sit and eat the picnic. But instead, hello, her pigeons. Do you know how good's that? They know they can trust us. Oh, that's only young, isn't that? Yeah, then, hello. 
not scared of these dogs or me, these lot, and you don't know. But uh, yeah, we, we would, uh, look at that, nice weather for you, you lot, is it? It's a nice weather for ducks. Has anybody bothered asking you? What's that? No, you're not keen? I don't blame you. Yeah. you, you, you you've spoilt an expression there, though. Yeah. Like water off a duck's back and all. Oh, I'm not filming water dropping on you. But, uh, yeah, that was our plan. It's been scuppered and, and bollocks, basically. Oh, yeah, footpath being done up there. Oh, right. doing a good job. Belting in here, you know. So, uh, do you know, I'll finish the sentence yet. Uh, yeah, it's, um, it, it's spoiled it because, we, we, you know, according to weather, you, you do weather, don't you, on the internet, yeah? She said weather would go up be nice, and it's not. Yeah, it's manky, manky bloody weather. <laughs> Trixie, come here. I tell you what, they're doing, they're doing enough for you. Busy, 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 busy. And there's the fainting over there. So what are we going to do instead? Well, here's the plans. And uh, how's, how's this for your birthday? Bloody hell. Rosie is going to come back in a bit. We're going to have her breakfast. And the next plan is she has a bath. Because you need a bath, don't you? Look, look, look at that bloody ball thing. That's manky, that. Eh? See, she's dropped it. I'll show you. Show you what she's dropped. Call this a ball. Look at that. Eh? That's it. Yeah. Still happy with it, though. Come on. Rosie. Come on. We need to be out there so we don't get run over. Come on. Oh, I'll fetch you three quarters of a septic ball with you. Eh? Bloody hell. In the event of a nuclear war, the only things that will survive will be cockroaches and that ball. That, that is minging. Uh, so, yeah, so that's the plan for after. Rosie's going to have a bath. Rosie, come on over here. Here. Come here. And a man doing the old adult give a shite routine. Come on, I don't want you to get them over. Rosie. Here. Come here. Rosie. That's called independent and defiant. Rosie, come here. Come on. See, she's all right. Eh? Bloody bad Max here. I don't want him running you over. And um, Trixie, so yeah. Right. Get your bloody words out. Don't you look at that, that's wet, isn't it? And you usually farm water it is. So. Let's do it like how this morning you present. And on today's programme, uh, Rosie. Hey, come round this way. Jesus, H. Hey, you determined, bloody crap me up, you. With, with these lot. Eh? I don't want them running you over. Because eh? then I'll have to do for them. Aye. So, uh, uh, coming up on today's programme, uh, in a bit. Rosie will be having a bath. After that, we'll be chilling out. Then, we're going to go in Wigan. Not, not these, because these don't need to go. We're going to get them a cake. And she's going to have a chicken foot market. Oh, you can't give dogs cake. Bollocks, now do we? Eh? We look after our animals. Look at that, 14 years old. Eh? Eh? She's not just lived off dry biscuit and pedigree chub. So, yeah, so she has a cake as well. We're having a cake, you know, just for help her out. So she doesn't feel on her own. And then later on, she's going to the vets. Yeah, a bloody injection on her birthday, because her legs out what they were. What were they? Well, they were legs and they still are, but you know what I mean? She just needs a bit of extra help, some steroids, and she's going to the vets for it. Anything else in between, we just make a big fuss of her, spend the day together as a family. And, uh, you know, for those of you who don't know, who don't have animals, you say, oh, you don't celebrate your dog's birthday, do you? You do it for your kids. Think about it this way. Does everybody like your kids? And are your kids even nice? Oof, controversial. <laughs> so that's it. That's Trixie. And that's Rosie. This is me, I think. Well, the last time I checked it was. Have a good day. And please, please wish Rosie happy birthday. Ta-da.